All right, here we are at incarceration, day two still. Right now, if you don't recognize these guys, you should. Let's introduce themselves here. Hey, I'm Fran. I'm Ryan. And, and from? We are Light the Torch. Light the Torch. Now, um, you guys just came off, right? Yes. Yeah. 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 And I got to see a little bit of it, and you guys really kind of played to the crowd. You guys kind of are really in, into what you're doing absolutely um, does that just come is that just a natural thing or do you guys feed off the uh, how does that come to you then um, I think now that we've been a band for a while and before that being W you know and a lot of the crap that we went through we kind of stuck with it and now with the new record coming out as light the torch we're just starting to feel the, the benefits of it so yeah. we've got a lot of life in the band and we're all really stoked. It's kind of like a second wind. Being, you know, we toured a lot in our 20s, yeah. and now we're in our late 30s and 40s, and we still love it. So, yeah. you know, we're not taking it for granted and just going. Yeah. Um, the, the devil you know, I still have music. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I do I still have music that I have from, nice. from yeah. the We back. still play a couple songs here and do there. Do you? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I guess you call them covers. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Tributes to yourself. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so what was with the change? I mean, was it just a necessary change? It just not in name, but maybe in in everything? Or how did Yeah, it was not something we wanted, obviously. It was, uh, I mean, changing names is a big deal. So yeah. we, had, it was, you know. All, uh, all business related and yeah. past members and just trying to, can't tour with the name, so we, this is a really good chance to reinvent ourselves. Okay. And we all, you know, we didn't go, hey, what should we write to be, you know, to make big? It's like, no, we just kind of, we all grew up playing blast beats and crazy fast music. So it's like, hey, why don't we just like, we're getting older, <laughs> let's slow it down. Yeah. Let's slow so, us down, but pick yeah. the music up maybe. <laughs> I'm not yeah. that old, but I'm old enough to say, tone it down, bro. Yeah. <laughs> So, you know, it's cool. I, I really enjoyed the uh, the process, and the process I'm really insane. enjoying the music that we're playing. So, yeah. it's cool. I mean, you guys get up there, and I mean, you guys, I, really, I mean, I, I was really impressed on how everything, you know, kind of just, the crowd just really feeds into you guys, and, and, and I, I don't know, do you still think they know you as, or do more uh -huh. people identify you now? Oh, I think for sure more people identify us as like the Torch than yeah. W yeah. No wasn't around long enough. We didn't tour enough or aggressively enough to really right. make a name name for ourselves. So it wasn't. I mean, we we definitely started over from from the ground up again. You know, because yeah. you can't book a new name and hope that the old fans show up. So you know, with booking agencies, everything everything was starting over. So, yeah. <laughs> but so I, think, I think they know us <laughs> more like the Torch nowadays. Yeah. Sure. So um, when you guys came here, and uh, did you guys play this last year? No, no, no. When you guys came here and saw, holy shit, we were really, it's really a prison. Oh and yeah. Was it like really? I mean, I I, we awesome. showed up and I was like, this is fucking cool. Oh yeah, <laughs> absolutely. We, we went uh, and took the tour. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, so yeah, we got here and the first thing we did, we went to go do the tour, and they're like, we don't open for another hour and a half, so. We hung out and waited an hour and a half <laughs> and went back and you know, me and Francesca went together and we were just like wandering around checking out the you know the uh, the prison section of it yeah. like the cell block in the hospital it's crazy it's, it's, it it's crazy. crazy history and you know and then also you know it's famous from the movie so yeah. the combination of the two it's it's pretty cool yeah I, it, it's really crazy you know I, I, I posted a picture of, of the bars and, and how how high they go up oh and yeah how small yeah. the cells and I. And oh, this sounds so small. Now? Yeah. <laughs> you know? I, yeah. And what was most impressive to me is they didn't touch it. Like, right. they just left it as is, and the areas you can't go, like, the paint is peeling yeah. off the walls everywhere. I it wanted looked, a piece of, of a lead paint. Yeah. Chip it's, off it's fucking terrifying. <laughs> like, yeah. if yeah, I would cool. not want to just walk around there by myself at night, it's cool. Like, it looks like a horror movie it does it and really they did does. just didn't they the only thing they did is just did nothing yeah it's just aging the one room where the, it was the uh, halfway house yeah is the one they changed yeah. for the for the movie yeah they, they did where it says brooks was here and it's mm -hmm. always red um that was i think that's the only real change that they did really? for the movie wow uh, other than you know some of the other you know different sides when they threw the fish the fat guy off the yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. Know, but we, i think that was a little different but, but yeah i think the only thing was just the room that they changed i was i was really hoping that that we would get to go inside we were told like oh yeah 
Hey, it's called Incarceration Fest. This is who's playing. Also, side note, it's at the prison. And we're like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Absolutely. So yeah. we are. I've been hearing about this. I didn't know anything about it until we got offered the first this first year. So I mean, I would love to come back. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, it, it's so much. It's so much fun going in there. And even you go around and look at shit. And you go back in. And you're like, whoa, I didn't see that last time. And yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, very cool. Yeah. So, so what's up after this for you guys? What are you guys doing? Taking a couple months off, uh, riding, yeah. and then uh, we have stuff happening at end of October, and it's not announced yet, so right. we should talk. Yeah, it, but yeah. it's a really cool tour, so okay. we'll do that for five weeks, six weeks, yeah. something like that, and then more writing and think about the next record. Yeah, it's kind of like the wind down, right before you're gonna go do the record. Yeah, you got a couple tours still peppered in there, but you're writing the whole time when right. you're home. And it's also the couple months that you get some family time and stuff like that, and then starts the recording process and whatever tours you have left over. What else do you guys do on your time off? I mean, I know you got to write, I know you got to do the music and all things. I mean, everybody understands that. But is there anything else that you could do, like on a site, like you know, fishing, bowling? I mean, there's shit that you. Everyone's do? got a hobby in this band, man. Yeah. yeah let's start with this dude. What, yeah. What I do mean, you do I do. It's also like became somewhat of a job as well and uh, I do a lot of artwork visual effects and so I'm even on the bus yeah even on the bus I'm constantly doing that working okay. yeah yeah it's okay yeah he did our, our album he did the whole oh you did yeah. the album yeah no shit. he did all the artwork so, so. See, stuff that, like see, that that's, that's shit you like I mean you know I, I mean I can appreciate that being an artwork coming from the band because it makes it more personal to you guys. Oh, absolutely. You know, and, absolutely. And when, I mean, yeah, anybody can say, hey, I need graphic for an album cover or something to do that. But when it comes from you guys and, you know, you're like, hey, what do you guys think about this for our album, you know? Yeah. And everybody's like, yeah, that's fucking cool. Yeah. It's more personal. Uh, way, absolutely. I, I agree. Yeah, yeah. 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 And then so I what mean, do you do on your time? And then when I'm home, uh, I do a lot of painting and do airbrushing and stuff like that. Oh, okay. uh, I paint motorcycles and oh, no, pretty much just about everything. Um, artwork. Yeah, stuff. artwork. You know, one-off like uh, commission pieces, stuff like that, and do some leather tooling. Okay. Uh, and then when I'm not doing that, I like to fish and hunt and camp as much as I possibly can. Yeah. And you know, it gives me the the time between tours to do that kind of stuff. Yeah. And then uh, just we're occasionally working at a welding shop here and there. Oh, okay. Yeah, buddy of mine. So. So you guys got you guys got quite a bit going oh, on on yeah. this side there. Everyone right? in this band does, <laughs> and then. As soon as we get off tour, you know, we hear Howard's gonna go fly out and work on a project oh, with, really? with a buddy of his, and you know they'll go do this, or he's gonna go and do this interview, or you know go Jimmy Joss's podcast. You know, he's just busy doing that stuff, and he also really likes to fish, and he likes to hike, walk. He's constantly walking. You'll see him pacing. He's got headphones in. He won't hear anything so just like people try to talk to him and he doesn't even hear you no really? he's just on a quest he's just burning calories man just rocking no shit. oh yeah he's he's in miles before we wake up in the morning really absolutely now we get up um early to go to the gym before work but yeah i don't do how that. early um i don't know we get up what six yeah meet at the, uh, her and i meet at the gym about six six fifteen i think howard averages about four a.m oh my yeah, yeah no. And he's up, he's up, and because we, we go places, we get to the city early, yeah. park up, so we can all just sleep, and yeah. he's up. He he's just up walks. Tall. He walks. Oh, yeah. I'm 50, I don't do that shit. I'm good. I humped in the desert. I don't do, I don't do that shit no more. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, what... When you guys when you guys uh, redid, did you guys keep the same sound? I want to get back to the, to the yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you guys basically keep the same sound that you had? Not or really. Was it a completely really. different input? Well, also because the I think everything changed. Yeah, everything really yeah. changed. The approach, everything. Yeah, very different approach. I think it's something that we had talked about. We we had been wanting to do what this became for a yeah. long time and, and it's just like you know you're also we were collaborating with a person who had different kind of style different kind of thing so it's also not that part wasn't really working out the way you know it yeah. is working out now okay so that's that's also a big thing so yeah the, the sound i would say the sound changed but it's not a thing where you know it was not a calculated like 
anything that it would just, just right. like we, it, just, it just it, it just happens like happens. yeah we that's this is exactly what we wanted to do it just yeah. We, yeah it it is a drastic change in style but none of it was pushed like whatsoever like yeah. that's what came to the table is what you hear and that's kind of like well, we 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 had an intention <laughs> of changing the sound obviously but it happened really organically yeah so it was really cool yeah well it was great on stage you guys put on a hell of a show I thank was you there. Um, she was out there taking photos, so you'll see about on our website. We'll share nice. some with you awesome. guys. Awesome. Um, and you'll get the review and everything that we do for the whole thing. Um, right on. But yeah, you guys did a great job. I'm really kind of, uh, I really kind of like the direction you guys are going in. It, Thank you. You know, because the whole change and everything. Yeah. And, We're, it, it, I, and I know it's hard because I talk to a lot of bands who say, you know, well, we lost these bands, we uh, lost these members. And sometimes we it doesn't work. Oh, yeah, yeah. You, you exactly. reinvent yourself. Sometimes it doesn't work and you get shelved. Yeah. It sucks. Yeah. It's a very, very, very real possibility. So the fact that it worked out in our favor is we. This is really like our baby. So yeah. We clean slate and start over, and we're really, really happy with what's going on. So we just we're. It shows on stage. Like we yeah, enjoy it. Does. We have a lot it of really fun. Really does. Yeah. What? It, um. Where can we get? Where can people get your stuff? Your merch, albums, obviously downloads, but hard copies and stuff like that. I mean, you know, with social media, you pretty much get all the links, and we have all those links. Yeah. I personally, I mean, we don't deal with any of it. Okay. We're fair, we're fairly active but through Instagram. It's, it's either, so easy to find. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm not gonna have a link right now that right. for, for you guys, but <laughs> yeah. it's, Jesus Christ, it's yeah. 2019. Click, it's, click follow right here. Google. Well, we're gonna. Well, we Google share everything. Exists. You know, yeah. we, we yeah. share everything that you know. And if you guys got uh, your art pages, we'll, uh, I'll share those too. Cool. cool you know, cool. because I mean, I know, you know, I know that you know. Bands don't make a whole shit ton of money, and we try and share everything we can for you guys to help you, you know, Absolutely. progress in, in your own manner. But at least we can try and do something. Yeah. For you we're we're uh, so. we're pretty active through our Instagram too. We try we try to answer questions the best we can. Okay. There's a lot. I mean, people get it gets buried kind of quick, but like. He'll be on it. I'll be on it. A lot of the times, I'm posting stuff. Okay. So, if you, I don't, if you have questions, sometimes we can get to them. Sometimes we can't, but we yeah. really do try. Okay. All right. Check these guys out. Uh, they just came off stage. You're gonna love the new show. The new, the new band. Everything. Everything about it is just fantastic. So check them out, and hopefully, we'll be seeing you guys real soon. Asgard. All right, guys. Thank you very thank much for your time.